pictures. In this video I'm just going to show you uh, a sort of cutting blur effect you can create now using the Pass Blur tool in Photoshop CC 2014. Now I've got a design here and first thing to do go to the filter blur gallery Pass Blur. Okay actually to get rid of all the pins if you want to remove all pins so start from a now first thing to do is click down here and just gonna double click up here so it stops any more additional pins and I'm gonna get rid of the centered blur don't want that I just want it in one direction I'm gonna set the speed not too fast so I don't want it slow down too much when I'm just doing this video and now I'm going to start from the top this time and go downwards now it would be nice if there was a feature to be able to control it so it's a straight line so you can obviously do that but you if you want it straight just to carefully line it up double click again and now I'm just going to go other the bottom double click and of course just there, down again, then bottom, back up to the top, top, and in the bottom. So you just right, and there you have it. Basically, a quick cutting sort of blur effect. Obviously, if you wanted to create a really fine one, you could actually create maybe 10, 15 pins across, and obviously many other variations which I'm going to explore over the next few weeks but certainly that's one way of creating a nice sort of cutting sort of obviously with not just letter A you could use it with other designs as well. I hope you found this uh, quick tutorial of interest.